So good morning, everyone. Welcome to this chair yoga practice. Uh, hopefully you're all doing well today. So all you need is a chair and a mat, maybe. Or you don't need one, not really. So just get yourself all comfortable on your chair. Sit up, try to sit up as tall as you can. Maybe wiggle your bottom around a little bit to get yourself all, all the wiggles out and comfortable. And then wherever you'd like to sit, if you need to sit up again and to support yourself against the wall or something, go ahead and do that. Or in a chair or wherever you want to be. So root down through your feet. So your knees should be approximately over top of your ankles. Sit up nice and tall. Draw your belly button in just a little bit. Bring your shoulders up to your ears. Roll them back and down. Okay. Let's take a few breaths through the nose, exhaling it out through the mouth, and then go ahead and close your eyes. So breathe in and let it out. Two more times. Inhale and exhale. Last time, inhale and exhale. And then just close your eyes. So relax your arms and your hands down on your lap. Hands can be palms face down or palms face up. Notice how each feels and which one feels the best on your, in your body. And then just take a few moments here just to, to allow yourself to settle, noticing what's happening in your body. And then begin to notice all around you, the space that you're in and how you feel in this space that you're in. What emotions come up when you think about the space that you're in? Allow your other senses to become a little stronger. So what do you hear? What do you feel? See if you can pick up on all those little things. And then draw your attention towards yourself, towards your chair. Notice yourself sitting on the chair. See if you can be the observer. So you're kind of put yourself outside your body for a moment and just watch yourself sitting on your chair. What you look like sitting on that chair. So this is kind of like an imaginary exercise. So just just imagine, envision yourself looking at yourself sitting on the chair, noticing what you're wearing, how you're sitting, what the chair looks like, and the space that the chair is in. You have to maybe paint yourself a picture or draw yourself a picture in your mind of yourself sitting on that chair. It's not actually not that easy, but just do the best you can. And now bring yourself onto the chair. So you are now on the chair. You're watching yourself. Not really watching yourself. You are on the chair. How do you feel on the chair? Notice the chair underneath your bottom. 
how it feels. You might have a cushion there. It might be just a solid surface. Different chairs, you might have some kind of uh, a little dip in the seat. There might be different textures that you might feel. Notice where the edge of the seat goes into your thighs, where you're supported there. And then bring your attention to your feet, feeling them in the ground, supported. To so push down with those feet a little bit more, push down into the seat a little bit more, and then just lift up through your spine, soften your shoulders. Take a few breaths here, just noticing. Noticing your foundation, your stability. At the same time, notice maybe what your face is doing, what your mind might be doing, what the rest of your body's doing, and any other sensations that might come up. And then bring your awareness to your mind, noticing what's going on in the mind. What kind of sensations are coming up there? What kind of thoughts? And then when you become aware of your breath, just watch it. You can open up your eyes anytime that you like, if that feels better to you. Let's watch your breath moving in and out of your body. See if you can get that breath a little bit deeper, a little bit fuller. Just find a really nice rhythm to your breath. Let's get that breath deeper and fuller. And let's begin to count our breaths. So as we breathe in, count how long it takes you to breathe in, and then count how long it takes you to exhale. It might change as well too. The inhale and the exhale, it might be the same, it might be different. And then every time you breathe, it might be a little bit different too. That's okay. Just notice these things. Okay, on your next inhale, let's count for a count of four in through the nose. One, two, three, four. As you exhale, exhale through the mouth and do a count of four. Four, three, two, one. Let's do that two more times. Inhale through the nose, count of four. And then exhale through the mouth, a count of four. Four, three, two, one. One more time. And then exhale for a count of four. One, two, three, four. Okay, the next time we breathe in for a count of four, we're gonna bring the arms all the way up. And then exhale all the way back down again. 
and inhale for a count of four. One, two, three, four. Exhale through the mouth. One, two, three, four. Have that movement be the same as the breath. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two, one. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Exhale, four, three, two, one. The next time we're going to do that, we're going to hold the breath for a moment. So inhale for one, two, three, four. Let's hold the breath for four, three, two, one. Exhale, four, three, two, one. If that was too hard for some people, don't hold it for that long. Inhale for four, one, two, three, four. See if you can hold the breath for four, three, two, one. And exhale, four, three, two, one. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Hold it, four, three, two, one. Exhale, four, three, two, one. And let's just bring your hands onto your lap and just notice how that felt. if it was comfortable or if it was not comfortable. And maybe what you did to change it, if you did at all, or if you just allowed that discomfort to be a part of you and just be curious about that discomfort. Okay, let's bring the arms all the way back up and let's big circles, roll them back and down. And then bring them up in front of you and big circles. Let's do that one more time. Inhale, lift up, and big circles down. And then let's do the same way going forwards. Big circles up, and coming back down, and big circles up, and coming back down. I lost count, so let's do that one more time. Coming back up, and then bring your hands to prayer above your heart and bring it down to your heart. Okay, so sitting up nice and tall, we're just gonna do a little twist here. So inhale here, and then exhale, just twist over to one side. Inhale, come back to center, and exhale, twist over towards the other side. Come back to center, and exhale, twist. Inhale, back to center, and exhale, twist. Good, inhale, back to center. Let's bring the arms all the way up. And take that right hand, bring it down onto the edge of your chair. You can hold onto the chair if you like. And then we're gonna side stretch over to one side. Inhale, lift up, and bring the left hand down, side stretch over towards that left side. You can hold onto the chair, not up to you. Inhale to lift. One more time on each side. And over towards the right. Don't fall off the chair. Make sure you're planted firmly on your bottom and on your feet. And then over, move over towards that left side. Good. Inhale up. And then let's roll those wrists around as we come all the way down. Really get into those fingers and joints. And then rotate them in the other direction as the hands come all the way back up again, wiggling into those joints and fingers. Yeah. And then wiggle them around like little spiders. Wiggle, 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 wiggle as they come down. You can rotate if you like, up to you. Just wiggle them in. Good. And then shake out those arms. Good. Let's bring those feet a little bit wider apart. So the feet are nice and wide. You're gonna root down through those feet. They can, the toes can be turned out if you like. Entirely up to you. Okay. And then we're just going to, we're gonna move around in some circles. Move around in some circles. Get into the shoulders. 
moving around. You can go down as low as you want, up to you. Round and around. One more time in this direction, and we're gonna stay here, low down here, okay? Placing your hands on your thighs, and we're gonna do some cat and cows. So inhale, a cow here, and then exhale, round out the back. Inhale, cow. Exhale, round out into your cat. Make sure you're firmly supported. Inhale, cow. And exhale, cat. One more time. Inhale, cow. And exhale, cat. Okay, and come back to that neutral position and then we're going to go around in the opposite direction hopefully i am going in the opposite direction it's funny how your mind plays little tricks on you like honestly i really don't know if i'm going in the same direction or not so i'm going to switch directions <laughs> so you do the same thing if you feel like you're not going in the right direction or you're Doing the same thing, change it up. I guess that's what happens as we get a little older. We forget, tend to forget things. I tend to do that a lot. Okay, get right into those hips and lower back. Okay, and then we're gonna come back to our forward again. We're gonna do a few more, five more sets of cat and cow. So drop the belly, open up through the chest, lift up the chin. Exhale, round out the back to our cats. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Inhale, cow. I believe this is the third one. And exhale, cats. Inhale, our cow. Exhale our cat, and then we got one more to do. Just moving in time with your breath, paying attention to all the different sensations that are coming up, any emotions, any feelings, and then sitting up nice and tall. Okay, so let's move the feet towards each other and then move them away from each other. Move them as far as you can and then wiggle them again. So you're kind of moving your feet back and forth if you everyone can see my feet so moving them apart and then moving them together so this going back and forth can everyone see my feet so we're just wiggling them and back and forth Okay, let's add in the arms on this. So as we go in outwards, moving the arms back and forth, and as we come in, we're moving them back together. And back, outwards. Boy, that takes a lot of coordination. <laughs> Boy, and I'm really not in time with myself. We're supposed to be having the arms and the legs do the same thing. And I, I am definitely not coordinated here at all. But you know what? That's okay. <laughs> I'm not judging. Okay, let's bring that all back. <laughs> and get, bring the arms all the way up above our head. And we're going to reach forwards towards our toes. They might reach the toes. They might not. Don't fall off the chair. Reach towards your toes. And then lift yourself all the way back up again. Go nice and slow so you don't get dizzy. Exhale all the way down. Reach down towards your toes. And then lift yourself all the way back up again. One more time. Reach down towards your toes. Exhale it all the way out and then inhale, lift it back up again. Reach up as high as you can. Then you're going to draw that right knee in towards your chest. Give it a little hug. And some ankle circles. 
sitting up as tall as you can. The knee might not come up as high as I'm doing it. It might be down here. You might need to hold on underneath your thigh, or it might just be a little lower. Just go to where you can go. Go in the opposite direction too. And then bring that leg down. Okay, plant that leg down, left, lift the left leg up. Bring it up as high as you can. And again, this leg is, it might be, feel different too. So doing some ankle circles one direction, just go to where you can go. So the most important thing is to sit up straight. So if the leg needs to come down here or maybe even only a little, like an inch off the ground, that's fine. So do opposite ankle circles. Let's take the left leg and cross it over. Maybe tuck that, that uh, left ankle or left toes on behind if you can. If not, it can be up here. It can also be down here, okay? There's always that option too, okay? Open up the arms to a T. I'm gonna take the left arm and bring it underneath the right arm. Twist the arms around, hold it here. Okay, and then we're gonna inhale, lift up. And exhale, we're just gonna round down. Let's do that again. Inhale to lift. Exhale to round. Inhale to lift. And exhale to round down. Good. And then inhale, come back to center. Unwind the arms, unwind the legs, and then just give them a little shake. And then push yourself up to stand. Okay. So root down through your feet. We're going to actually try that eagle pose again, holding on. So you might want to hold on with two hands. You might want to hold on with one hand. We'll just see what we're going to do. So we're actually going to, let's do the legs first. So root down through your right foot, put a little bend into it, and then take your left leg and then cross it over. And it might be just down here like this. It might be up a little bit more. You might be able to twist all around. And I, you actually might surprise yourself. You might actually be able to, to let go for a moment <laughs> or not, and that's okay. So we're just gonna do the legs just for now. Okay, and just hold it there, just practicing balancing on one foot. And again, you might need to hold on with two hands. And if you are, then maybe the chair is in front of you. You might only cross at the ankle and just play around with that, noticing how that feels underneath your foot, that right foot that's connecting to the ground. You might have the toes of the left foot. And just notice maybe you can bend into your supporting knee a little bit and maybe just do like a little seat. Maybe you just need to sit a little bit and that will give you a little bit more support. So try that out and see what happens. You might be wiggly woggly, that's okay. Okay. And then let's undo those legs and then shake them around a little bit. And let's try on the other side. So if you need to move your chair around, do that. Root down through that left foot. Put a little bend in the knee, take your right leg and cross it over. And again, it can be at the ankle, or you might wanna bend into a little bit more and do a little seat and then bring those feet around and see if you can balance there, either with holding on with two hands or one hand, or maybe, look, I can do no hands. <laughs> Just see what happens. Notice what you're doing here. Maybe you need to release a little bit just to get yourself a little bit more comfortable. Good, and then we'll come out of that and then shake them out. And then we'll just do the arms by themselves. So root down through both feet. Okay, we're gonna bring the arms out into a T. Okay, take the right arm and we're gonna bring it on top of the left. Right. I'll bend at the elbows and maybe twist around at the wrists. And just hold those elbows down towards your chest, standing up as tall as you can. Okay. And then 
We're gonna take a big breath in. We're gonna take those arms all the way up. And on our exhale, we're gonna bend the knees a little bit and see if we can go forwards. So just go to where you can go, okay? So you might not be able to go as far as I can go or anyone else, and that's okay. You might just only come down like maybe an inch. You might be even able to touch your toes, but just go to where you can feel some stability and that you don't lose control here, okay? And if you have to, maybe you, you have the, ha the chair here and then you just come and you touch the chair with your hands and then come back up again. Okay, we're gonna try that one more time. Just go where you can go. And then come back up again. Okay, and then unwind those arms, open them up nice and wide and then bring them down. Let's do some shoulder circles. Okay, and then we'll do the other arm. So bring the arms up and open again, root down through both feet. Take the left hand arm and bring it on top of the right. Elbows are bent and you're just going to twist the arms and hands together. And just notice how it might feel totally different on the side. Hug those elbows in towards your chest standing up nice and tall. Okay, and then again, we're gonna to try to do that little forward fold again. So inhale to lift. And then exhale, bend into your knees, and then you're just gonna bend forwards. Just again, go where you can go. We're gonna do that a couple more times. Inhale to lift, and maybe use the chair again as your guide. So you might go exhale, go down, and then come back up. Let's do that one more time. Exhale. And inhale. Good. And then unwind those arms, open them up nice and wide. Bring the arms down and then just do a few little shoulder shrugs, forwards and backwards. maybe one at a time. And then let's see, maybe, perhaps maybe we can put that together. So let's root down through our right foot. Keep your, ch your chair handy and maybe, maybe in front of you. Okay, I'm just not gonna have it in front of me, just be so you can really see me if you need to see me. So root down through your right foot, take your left leg and cross it over. So maybe for this one, you need to have a little bit of a kickstand. So place that foot down in front of you. Or if you want to, you can wiggle it around. But we're going to try to do the arms at the same time. So just be aware of what's happening here. The arms are going to come out. And then you're going to take that left hand and bring it underneath the right. Yes, you are. <laughs> okay, so we're going to have to find some balance here. And if this isn't working for you, maybe just bring one arm up and you're holding on with one hand but you find what works, what works for you. Okay, we're just gonna take a moment here. We're not gonna move unless you really want to move. You don't need to, you might just stay here and just notice what's happening. If you feel like moving, you can lift those arms up and then see if you can bend low, but you don't have to, okay? And, and again, you can break this down and just do the, the arms or just the legs. Okay, that's totally up to you. And then let's unwind the arms, open them up, unwind the legs, and let's just shake everything out here. Give a little shake. And let's try the other side. So if you, again, if you need to move your chair, again, your chair can be in the front of you or towards the side. And just realize that that chair is there for support if you need it. Okay, and now we're gonna take that right leg and cross it over the left. So you might wanna have that little kickstand here or you might wanna bring it all the way around. You decide what works best for you, but make sure that you find some really good support here. Okay, and then you're gonna open up your arms and this time the right arm's gonna come underneath the left. Okay, find where you can balance. You might want to sit down a little bit more 
or straighten up a little bit more. Maybe just do the legs or just the arms. Maybe you just need to hold on here. And then if you feel like it, you can go forwards if that's working for you. You decide. Maybe take one more breath here. Feeling the stability underneath those feet or that foot. And then unwind the arms. Unwind the legs. Let's give ourselves a nice big stretch. Reach up. Maybe stretch it out, little side bends here. Wiggle the fingers, wiggle the toes, and then bring those arms and legs all the way down, or toes all the way down, and we're going to come back into a seat. Okay, so sitting up. What time do I have? Okay, so sitting up here. I'm going to try a couple sun salutations. Okay. So get yourself planted into your seat. Feet are into the ground. Okay. We're going to inhale the arms all the way up. And we're going to go forwards. Exhale all the way down. And then inhale, come all the way back up again. Good. And then exhale, bring the hands all the way back down. Inhale the arms all the way up. And we'll do a forward bend. Forward bend, going down as far as you can go. And then we'll go halfway up. So placing those hands onto your thighs, halfway up. And let's move ourselves into a little cow. And then exhale, cat. And then inhale the arms all the way back up again. And then exhale, bring those arms all the way back down. Okay, inhale the arms all the way up. Exhale, forward fold, reach down as far as you can. Halfway lift. So hands on your thighs, little cow here. Exhale, a cat. Inhale, come all the way back up. Reach the arms out into a T. We're gonna do our, cat, our, our eagle arms again. Right arm over top of the left arm. Twisting the, the arms around. Inhale to lift up those arms. Exhale to go forward bend. Inhale to lift up the arms again. And then exhale, unwind the arms, open them all the way back up again. And let's do the same on the other side. Left arm comes over top of the right arm, twisting the arms around. Inhale to lift. Exhale to fold. Inhale to lift again. And then unwind those arms. Open them up nice and wide. Arms come all the way up. Bring that right knee up. And maybe holding on to that right knee. Hug it in towards your chest. Exhale, bring that leg down. Arms come all the way back up again. And now the, the left leg comes all the way up. Holding on to that left leg, squeeze it in towards your chest. And then inhale, bring the arms up, leg comes down, and forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold, and bring your arms all the way back up again. Reaching up as high as you can. And then exhale, hands towards your heart. Just take a moment here. Taking a few breaths. Let's be aware of everything that's going on around you, everything that's going on in you, noticing your breath. Okay, let's try that one more time, or a version of that one more time. Okay. So inhale those arms all the way up. Exhale, forward fold. Reach down towards your toes. 
And then inhale, lift those arms all the way back up. And bring those hands back towards your heart. Okay, let's try again. Inhale the arms all the way up. Exhale, open up your arms nice and wide and go down, reach down towards your toes. Inhale halfway up this time, hands onto the thighs. Exhale, forward fold. And then inhale, come all the way up, reach the arms all the way up. Exhale, hands towards your heart. Okay, inhale the arms all the way up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, come all the way back up. Reach up. And then arms come into a T, right arm comes over top of the left arm, twist your arms around. This time the right leg, the left leg is going to come over top of the left and we're gonna hold it here. Good, and then inhale to lift the arms all the way up. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, all the way back up again. And then exhale, Back to center, untwist the legs, untwist the arms, open up nice and wide. Arms come all the way up and forward fold. Inhale to lift. And then open up the arms again. Left arm over top of the right arm, twisting the arms around. And the right leg comes over top of the left. Inhale to lift. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale to lift. Exhale, unwind the legs, unwind the arms, open them up nice and wide. Arms come up and forward fold. Inhale, arms all the way back up again. One more time, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Let's do a little cow. Exhale, round out your back into a cat. One more time, cow. One more time, cat. Push the beer back into the chair. And then inhale, bringing your arms all the way up. And exhale, hands towards your heart. Just take a moment here. Breathe and notice. Okay, open up your eyes, bring the arms all the way up. I'm going to do a little twist. Exhale, twist over to one side. Just bring your right hand or your left hand down onto your thigh. And maybe your other arms reaching over top of your chair, or you can hang onto the back of your chair, sitting up nice and tall. Try to root down through both cheek, cheeks of your bottom, soften through your shoulders. And just take a few breaths here, just noticing where you're tensing up, Next breath, you're going to bring the arms all the way back up, come all the way back to center. And let's twist over towards the other side. And maybe you can't twist as far, maybe you can twist further. Bring one arm, the opposite arm to the opposite thigh, and the other arm is going to reach maybe back towards the back of your seat, or the arm of your seat, or the side of your chair, soften through your shoulders. Try to make sure that both bottoms, both bottom cheeks are settled into your chair. I'm just taking a breath here. Soften where you can soften. And don't force it. Don't try to go into a position that is not as comfortable as you can make it. Try to soften here. On your next breath, bring your arms all the way up. And then exhale, bring your arms down. 
Let's do that one more time. Inhale the arms all the way up. Reach up as high as we can. Let's wiggle those fingers, bringing the arms all the way back down. And I kind of fibbed here. Let's do that one more time. Inhale the arms all the way back up. And let's do one more twist. Go into it more gently, maybe. Don't force it so much. Adjust where you need to adjust. Notice what's happening when you're in with your feet as you're in this pose. What's going on there? Are your toes coming up or are your heels coming up? Are you moving over to the words of side on one foot? Okay, on your next inhalation, bring your arms all the way back up. Come back up to center, wiggle your fingers, and then let's move over towards the other side. And again, notice again, try to get a little softer into this pose. A little bit more releasing and relaxing, not holding on. I just noticed I was really tensing up in my, in my bottom. So try to sink a little deeper into your seat and notice what you're doing with your feet. Is one toe reaching up? Are you moving on to the outside edges of your feet or the inside edges? Are you breathing? Okay, inhale to bring the arms all the way back up again and then bring the arms down and then let's rest ourselves so let's bring ourselves onto pushing into the back if you want to lie down on the ground go for it and we're going to re reach our legs out so try to get yourself comfortable here but you're very welcome to lie down on the ground if that's accessible to you and again your hands can come down and rest on your legs or on during on the sides of the chair. You can have palms up or down, whatever feels best to you. You can tuck your chin. But try to get yourself into a comfortable place just for a few moments here, just maybe a minute or two. And see if you can just release. So we're not trying to try to control anything, not trying to control our breath. Just go through your body one part at a time and maybe even asking it if, are you relaxed? So you could say to yourself, left arm, are you relaxed? Maybe left arm relax a little bit more. Right side of the body, are you relaxed? Relax a little bit more. And give your breath permission just to help you to relax. So breathe through those that you feel they're, are not relaxing. Try to soften through your faces, your jaw, through your lips.
And then very, very slowly bring yourself back. So that might mean bringing your awareness back to this room, allowing your breath to deepen, wiggling fingers and toes, drawing your feet back, maybe rolling over to one side, maybe giving yourself a big stretch. And then wherever you are, just coming into a seat, so either on your chair or on the ground. And gently blink open your eyes if that feels good to you. And I'm going to move right into some alternate nostril breathing. So again, there's a few ways of doing this, but try to take your right hand, right thumb connects onto your right nostril and either your pointer finger or your ring finger connects onto your left nostril. We're going to start with breathing in through the left first. Close off that left nostril, breathe out through the right. Breathe in through the right. Close off the right, breathe out through the left. Breathe in through the left. Exhale through the right. Breathe in right, and exhale left. So just going at your own pace. If you need to hold on to that right arm with your left hand, do so. Just allow yourself to alternate between the two nostrils, breathing in peacefully. Notice what's coming up as you do this, trying to remain calm. So grounding down through your seat and through your feet. rooted and supported. We'll do this two more times, breathing in through the left side, exit, finishing with the exhale out of the left side. So one more round. Then just bring your hands down onto your, your thighs. Ooh, it's windy out there. If you feel like connecting a little bit more, maybe bringing a hand to your belly and a hand towards your heart. Notice the rhythm there. The most powerful thing that you can do is getting back in touch with what's happening in the body. What's moving with the breath, with the heartbeat. When we can come in contact with those, both of those, and we can feel a nice strong foundation 
either in our seat or in our feet. We feel a lot more stability, stable, and a lot more grounded. And also feel a lot less stress and tension. You can feel more aware, a lot more clarity. So that we're able to make some decisions, some choices that we feel good about. Let's take just a few more breaths here, just feeling our breath moving through our bodies, our hearts beating, feeling the peacefulness that you hopefully you all feel at this moment. But maybe even though everything is kind of chaotic around us, we still feel peaceful. Okay, let's bring our hands towards our heart. Bow your head. Just give yourself a little bit of gratitude. In fact, actually a lot of gratitude. You know, doing things not in person is not an easy thing, especially when we're using technology that we're really not used to. It's totally out of our comfort zones. But we're all hanging in there, and I think that's, that takes a lot of resilience, a lot of strength. A lot of actually power. We have a lot of power within us, and we should be grateful for that, that we're able to do what we can do. So just take a moment now and reflect on your practice and never seen the lumps and bumps and... <laughs> different things that we had to move through, different situations that maybe we felt not very comfortable, but maybe places where we really felt that we had a choice that we could make. We felt comfortable in those choices. And let's finish off this practice today with one joint ohm. So let's take a breath in through the nose, sigh it out, and breathe in for one ohm. Oh. Namaste. Thank you all for being here, even though I might not have been able to see most of you because things just happen that way and that's okay. So hopefully everyone had a good practice <laughs> and how good, at least I got thumbs up from you. <laughs> I can see you, Allison, that's the only person I can see, but hopefully everyone had a great practice and hopefully everyone is calm and settled and i hope you can bring all that towards your day and whenever you feel like you are a little bit unsettled just bring your awareness back to your breath your breath actually can help you so much with any stress or any tension just take some nice full inhales and some nice long deep exhales okay so See you uh, next week for the chair yoga and on Wednesday for the yoga flow at 2 p.m. And have a great day. <laughs>